not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you should. Ready to fight? Ready. All right, so as we get this stand-up only fight underway, just a quick reminder on the rule set, no grappling or wrestling of any type, and fighters also cannot follow up with ground strikes on the canvas. So if you knock your opponent down, you cannot follow up with strikes. Very important to point that out here at the beginning of round one. Man, this is crazy, DC. These fighters are not trying to... And just inches away from landing one of those big... Oh, he's coming in, bro. Oh, he gets back up, but barely. Look how wobbly he is. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop in this contest at one minute, six seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new UFC lightweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. This man, of course, has had no shortage of challengers since coming to the UFC. And more often than not, he has had an answer for all styles. Bruce Lee, with authority, is your winner here tonight.